Hello and welcome everyone to Raven Tutorial, let's get right into it. When played right, Raven is super fast and awesome at grabbing beacons and can create top damage. It has no built-in weapons, no resistance, no shields but possesses double jump, decent HP and firepower. A high percentage of your success in battlefield depends on how you manage Raven's double jump. One wrong move and it becomes an easy kill. Here are some tips. Raven is vulnerable with no shields, so any weapon that requires the bot to stand out in the open with lengthy loadout is a bad mix. By far the best setup for Raven is RDB, Tulumbas and Pins, which allows Raven to quickly hit anything under cover and retreat if vulnerable. You can try out a close range Raven for fast attacks but its life expectancy is limited. Key to great Raven play is knowing how each target moves across the ground. Learn to spot on any bot from very far away based on its movement. Using RTBs can chew up any target in range or drop any shield very quickly. But to maximize the output, juicy targets are those without energy shields to which RTBs can create huge damage very quickly. Don't rush in, wait for jump and weapon reloads. This is not a race game, as with any other bot, take your time. Raven can move at 168 km per hour over 500 meters. Often beacons are unguarded, so check surroundings for range bots and jump at beacons. Raven doesn't need a shield if it uses its surroundings well or use other shields from other robots. Double team with a shielded bot such as a Lancelot or Ares. Learn operating without using jumps. When you use them, make sure it has a really good purpose like grabbing an unguarded beacon or getting out of a troublesome situation. Try not to often use your jumps to leap in for attacks. Very important is to know any rats that have range weapons that could hit you in the air. And this is part of knowing exactly what is around you in battlefield awareness. It's also worth telling that with the update 5.3, Raven gets extra 20% more damage for 8 seconds when he uses his jump, so you can jump fire your rockets to deal even more damage. Play solo in custom to learn exact points and markers on maps to know where to jump from to land exactly where you want. Solo custom also helps to practice which buildings to use as cover and angles where RDBs are effective. The best passive module is Repair Advanced Repair Unit. If you can carefully pick your targets, then you don't need Quantum Radar. The best active modules are double thermonews or best basic nuclear reactors if you can't afford these two. For knife fight raven, a last stand and anti-control is optimal. Pilot skills are best focused around adding more damage. This tutorial was made possible with the help of Lottie Rose aka the Raven Girl. She uses 5 Ravens in Champions League 
and manages to perform really well with those. Make sure to check out her channel, link in the upper right corner of the screen and down below. Take care and I'll see you next time.